Um, I learned many years ago in the corporate world that you don't check in luggage because when you check in luggage, there's a risk of luggage disappearing, which is a risk of you might end up at a client site or you might end up somewhere without the stuff you need. And that is not a risk you run. So in the corporate world, I learned to always fit everything, uh, I would say up to two weeks into a, into a, uh, you know, sort of hand carry luggage. And, uh, basically when I went on my own, I, I left the UK, so I was, I was living in the UK at the time and I went down on my own back in 2013 and I basically let go of everything I had and I, everything I needed, put it in a backpack and I can still do that today, 10, 11 years later. And, uh, that means, you know, 13, 14 kilos or so is usually what I can, uh, push it down to. And for me, it's a lot of it is part of freedom. Uh, I think not owning a whole pile of stuff, not being sort of committed to a lot of things and so on is, is very, very nice. During COVID, I was, let, let's call it stuck in Vietnam, uh, meaning I was in Vietnam for a year and a half, uh, where we were celebrating, not having so much COVID like everyone else, but, uh, it was such a nice feeling to leave after being there for a year, for a year and a half, because again, just naturally you accumulate a bunch of stuff and just let go of it, packing my backpack and traveling to Europe again was, uh, was very free. So I, I very much appreciate that. That's an amazing story. And, and yeah, I, I'm not sure I could even get down to 25 kilos, never mind 13. Um, but that's a, that's a fantastic story. And, and I guess speaks volumes to your own business ethos as well around focus and, and intention. Um, but before we kind of dive into that too much, if you would like to share just a, a five minute version of, of how you got where you are. 